I've been in finance or accounting work related since the day I completed my diploma in accountancy, which was in 1999. I've been improving myself in uh, work experiences as well as gaining more knowledge for the past 20 years, where I um, started my career as an accounts clerk and my last position was as a finance manager in a public listed company uh, before I embarked to this uh, real estate industry in 2018. When I just joined this company in 2015, I've enrolled myself with the local university here uh, to further my study on a part-time basis. I was graduated in uh, 2018 with a Master in Admin majoring in Finance. I believe every one of us should never stop learning in gaining knowledge, be it in learning about work and life experiences or academic knowledge. In my personal point of view, knowledge is everything. It is idea, it is power, it is choice and it is hope. I joined real estate industry in 2018. My main reason back then was because of the flexibility in time as my kids are growing up and I figured that I might not have enough time for them, for my family, with my job function and responsibilities at that time. When I first started my career in this industry, it took me months to adapt to the massive changes. Can you imagine 20 years in the finance line and suddenly jump into the sales line? From the back line to the front line? Oh my God, I cannot imagine back then. So, I, because back then I seldom communicate with people because I was only attached to the computer screen all the time. But I forced myself to jump out from the comfort zone, being my kids and my family as my push factor. I closed my first deal, first ever deal, only after six months. I was telling a lie if I said, I have always been positive and never gave up when I have no sales for six months. Six months, guys. To be honest, I did think of giving up. I was so stressed uh, with the pile-up bills, but the negative savings. However, my leader, Philomena, Gan, she has been very supportive. She has never give up on me. She always encouraged me and believe in me. She let me have the faith that with the willingness and the positive mindset, nothing is impossible. The sky is the limit and I can be whoever I want to be. Terus saya imagine itu awan sana atas. Mana lah saya mau sampai? Betul ke itu? The sky is the limit. Macam saya mau jadi pula itu, apa ni? Uh, astronaut kan? With the trust and respect, that I have for her. I trust her words. I joined Propnex in May last year together with her as the first batch. So in Propnex, I can tell you, it's even more transformation. For those of you who really know me, I believe you can tell what is the difference between me back then and then me now. I was promoted as a team leader in December 2019, which was last year. In this year, 2020, despite the coronavirus pandemic attack, I managed to become a goal achiever, twice super goal achiever, and twice platinum achiever. During the Propnex first convention, which was held recently, I was chosen as one of the top 100 award recipients for the year 2019. I feel grateful for all the awards achievement and I thank my husband actually for the support that he has given me, especially in taking care of the kids while I was doing my work outside, while I was going out to close deals. Because of his continuous support, I truly believe that I could strive for more platinum in the year 2021. I, Florence, thank you for next summer for every single support that you have given me in my greatest gratitude to the agency leaders, Stephon and Philomena, for the continuous trust and faith that they have always had in me. 
Thank you so much. God bless.